Hey, hey, hey guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with another episode of Ultimate Fishing Simulator. And we are back here at Betty Lake, and we're going to try a little bit of float fishing this time. Now, remember, in this lake we have most pretty much trout. There are five different species. I believe it's brown, brook, cutthroat, rainbow, and bull trout. And so far, the only thing I've gotten has been the cutthroat the rainbow and the browns so we're gonna see if maybe this will land us something a little bit different so let me first go ahead and show you what you have to do in order to do a setup for float fishing guys all right let me go ahead into inventory here now you can use any rod that we have right here these rods can either be for bait casting or float fishing it doesn't have to doesn't really matter we can even change the reels in fact I might go ahead and change my reel to something a little different let's see let's try this one oh, looks like that can only be all right cool okay that is a spin casting rod well we'll stick with this one for right now well, that's perfectly fine but in order to get this set up, first thing you need to do is you need to make sure you put your float on first. That seems to be the key thing here. And I'm going to pick this green one here. Go ahead and equip that. Once you do that, then you could set your depth. Now I'm going to go with a little bit deeper than 100 centimeters. I think I might go with 150 because some of the water here is kind of, kind of deep. Well, that's about as close as I'm going to get there. That's good enough. Then you want to go ahead and get your hook set up. I'm going to just pick one of these regular hooks here. Equip that. Then you want to go ahead and get your bait. And the only bait that we can really use for that is this particular type is the worm and possibly the boilies for some reason these guys don't seem to go much for the corn or the bread and to me that's not really right when it comes to trout trout definitely like corn and should go for them but we're not going to split hairs here now as far as float weights it will give you an indication as far as how many float weights you need but you need to get some of them in order to make this happen and for those you find them under other and you can purchase them right under here and I've got five because each one of them weighs a gram so I want to get it to the maximum level I'll wait to five of five grams that way the lure sits up or the float sits upright and let's go ahead and get it ready here guys now I've been doing a lot of fishing over here. I think I'm going to go over here this time. Now the last few times I've been here, I have been fishing in the morning. Now I had advanced time, which is something you can't do in this game. If you hit the control button, or the control plus button, and hit the two arrows, you can advance time to whatever time, or go back in the future to whatever time you want. But I think this is probably a good... Well, let's go... Let's go to... Well, that's... That's the middle of the night. Let's go somewhere around... Close to 6, that'd be about 4 p.m., wouldn't it? All right, it's starting to get 
near dusk and this is a prime time for fishing here guys so we're gonna see if we can't find something other than the rainbows or the browns maybe a brook trout I don't know if you can get all the way around this lake or not honestly I haven't tried I don't know if you can go up here or not looks like you can but I'm hoping that there's a brook over here. If there's a brook over here, then we can find some brook trout. And maybe some bull trout with a little bit of a little bit of rapids. I think that's what's over here, guys. I think we got us a brook. Yeah, this is pretty immersive. I mean you I really like this. It's pretty cool. And we got us a nice little rock over here to fish off of. But yeah, you can see a little brook over there, so we might be dealing with some different species here, guys. So let's toss this sucker out. I'm going to put the tension up just a little bit and we're going to check from the camera of, uh, camera's eye view or whatever you want to call it. See if there's anything swimming around. Alright, seems a little quiet over there. Yeah, honestly, I'm not seeing a whole lot of activity right there, because I can kind of see under the water at this point. But I tell you what, I do see activity over there. And that is one of the glitches I've noticed on here. Sometimes you can see under the water. I think they need some work over there, but I'm coming over here because I'm seeing some activity over on this side. Closer where this brook en enters into the water. Yeah, see all those little fish in there? Yeah, I want to see what we've got feeding into this. All right, let's see if we've got something a little different over here. Oh, yeah, we've got all kinds of fish here. And it looks like we might have somebody that's interested. Check it out. Now he's a brown, I'm pretty sure. Alright, he's got it. Let's see if he takes it. Oh. It's alright. I jerked just a little bit too soon. Yeah, timing is everything, guys. Timing is everything. I'm thinking those might be brook trouts there. Now this... No? I thought he was coming for it there for a minute. Okay, looks like we got us a rainbow that's interested. Let's make sure he takes it. There we go. We got him. Ooh. He is... He's strong. He's a strong fella. Alright, let's let him play with it a little bit. Let's let him run with it. Come on. Yeah, see the glitches over to the right, guys? That is kind of problematic, and that could be my settings, honestly. But it could be the fact that that's a glitch in the game. There's a few of them. Remember guys, this is a demo version. Gameplay seems to be pretty good. Oh, wow, you're really running with that, aren't you, you little bugger? This is probably kind of chancy. But I kind of want to muscle him over here a little bit. Get over here, you. 
I'm not messing around with you any longer. Get over here. Okay, we're going to take it down just a little bit. Yeah, I had my finger on that wheel in case he decided to bolt. Don't think he's my personal best, but he's decent. Yeah, my personal best is about 17 pounds right now on this game. So we'll see. Okay, he's trying to slack up the tension there a little bit. Come here, you. I'm not done with you yet. Nope, no, almost, almost. 17.07. .07. I was just a bit shy. Just a bit shy. Damn. I think we might need our flashlight. It's getting a little dark here. I'm going to go ahead and release him. Let's see if... Let's see what's over here. There's a lot of fish wandering around over there. Curious to see what's over here. Yeah, I'm not so sure if the brook trout are going to go for the float fishing or not. They may not. Honestly, wait a minute. Do I have a worm on there? No, I don't. I think I lost my worm. Yep, I think I lost my worm. I'm thinking all I had on there was a hook. Let me take a look here. <laughs> yeah, it'd have been kind of hard to catch anything with that. But I think while I'm doing, while I'm here, I might try one of these boily baits here. Well, that's interesting. I thought it was considered to be bait. It's not? I guess it's more like an attractant. Alright, let's go ahead and put a worm on there as well. Now, I've never used boily baits. That's the truth of it, guys. So... Never really used them in real life. Let's see if this tracks anything different. Got a lot of little fish swimming around on the bottom here. You know, truth be known, they may not have all five species. this is a demo version, they may just have the three for right now. Oh, wow. Hello. Come on. You can take it better than that. There you go. That's the way to handle it. All right. let's. You can run with it for a little while and play. Have fun. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Not for long, my friend. Not for long. You are going to come this way eventually. But we are going to let you tire yourself out first. Looks like I'm getting a lot... Getting a lot of rainbow action. That's about it. That glitch is really bothering me off to the right. Okay, let's... Tighten it up a little bit. He might be bigger than the last one. He's holding his own. Get over here. Okay, let's tighten it up a little bit more. Let's muscle him in.
Okay, I might have to keep this up because he's tension's getting too far down there. If I lose tension, it's just as bad as having too much. All right, we got him, guys. Nope, nope, nowhere close to this big. Nowhere as close. All right, I'm going to take a look here at this, these options, because this is really looking bad. <laughs> I mean, really looking bad. Let's take the rotter reflections and have none. Maybe that's part of the problem. Is that what it is? No, that's even worse. Look at that. That is a problem, guys. You're going to have to check into that. That you're going to have to check into. So it's not the reflections. Ah, that's it, guys. Take the water deformations off. Turn those off. That's what works. See how much better that looks? Oh, yeah. That's much better. Much better. And we have... Well... Come on. I know you're interested. You are just aching to grab that lure, aren't you? Come on. Seriously? Well, guys, I think... I'm not exactly 100% sure, but I think... I need to rebate this. <laughs> Yeah, that would help. That would help a little bit. Just a bit. Alright, let's throw that all the way over there. Way out in the middle of the lake. See if we can't find us a brook or a bull trout. Oh, come on, guys. You really don't want this nice, free food that's going to jerk your head off whenever you bite it? I'm curious what those little fast ones are that keep zipping on by. Whoa! Okay, he was big and I jerked too fast because I panicked. Got all worked up because I wasn't expecting it. <coughs> all right. Is he interested? No. Maybe. No. Maybe. Well, I guess not. There we go, guys. Let's wait for it to go under. And we got him. We got the little bugger. All right. Well, he's not real big. But he is going to make a run for it. I'll give him that. I 
All right, run. Where are you going to run to? Come on here, you. Come on, my friend. You are no catfish. You don't have the strength. He's coming. We'll have him in here in a minute. We're looking for better than 17 pounds, and I don't think this is going to be it. Okay, we're going to need to keep tension, keep tension, let go, keep tension, keep tension. Don't you even think about getting off of there, you little pain in the butt. There we go. 17.07. Tank on it. Still just missed it. Go ahead and sell him. Alright guys, I think we're going to try one more time. But I think I'm going to... I think I might come down here. What is over there anyway? There really is a brook right here. Huh. Is there anything up here further, or is it just... I thought there might be a, an actual lake over here, but I don't think that's the case. Alright, let's... Let me check my inventory here. I'm going to bring this depth down to about a I'm gonna take it to about 93 that's good enough looks like we are out of worms again looks like we're completely out of worms as a matter of fact let's go ahead and throw our line out there since this is close to the brook, I'm just kind of curious if there might be brook trout in here. We'll see if we get anything to bite, and if nothing... I think we'll call this an episode. But we got a fish heading in. We got incoming. It's another rainbow. And he's got it. Let's make sure he takes it. And he's got it. He has it. Alright. Take our tension down a little bit. He is going to take off with it. Well, he made some distance pretty quick. Ooh, watch the tension, guys. He's still into having a little power here. Whoa. Let's put a little bit of tension on there. Oh wow, he thinks he's just all that in a bag of chips. Yeah, he's getting tired now, guys. Sorry, my wife has a cold. We are slowly getting him in. Uh, 
I'm just going to kind of reel in for now. And give it a couple good tugs. Okay, we're going to have to keep the tension up again. He's coming. He's coming. This will be our final rainbow for the day. And there we go. 15.16. Eh. 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 I think I'll release his little finny butt. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. I was kind of nice to be able to walk around the lake and take a look at some of this. I'm glad we finally got that glitch thing fixed. Apparently, there's just something to do with that water distortion. Maybe something to do with my particular rig. I don't know, but it looks a heck of a lot better. I'm not getting all that weird stuff anymore. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And always remember, aim straight, cast far, and have fun. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.